In this episode of Fresh Paint, collegiate equestrians need your support. Purina's paying you back. And we've got concerts and rodeo in our future, and the World Show is gonna be great. Hi, I'm Billy Smith. Welcome to this episode of Fresh Paint, bringing you the latest news about paints and the people who love them. By now, you may have heard that the NCAA women's equestrian programs are in jeopardy. Already, Kansas State University has elected to disband its NCAA equestrian team in advance of an official NCAA decision about the future of women's equestrian as a Title IX compliant sport for universities. Obviously, we in the horse community think taking the only NCAA sport that includes horses as a central figure is a mistake. The horse community needs to stand up in support of women's equestrian and the young women whose futures are riding on the program. If your university has an equestrian team, make sure you support them. Make sure the athletic director of that institution understands how important NCAA equestrian is to the futures of these great students. In the meantime, we'll keep you informed and provide even more advice on how you can help keep horses in the NCAA picture. Good news, our corporate partner Purina is making it even more worth your while to use Purina products. Go online and learn more about Purina Bucks, a new Purina initiative that puts more buying power in the hands of APHA members. Purchase Purina products from participating dealers between now and the end of November and earn bucks to spend at corresponding year-end events that will feature live and silent auctions, raffles, food, entertainment, and more. Visit your local participating Purina dealer for eligibility, rules, and event promotion dates. Hands down, one of the great privileges of my job is developing friendships with some of the most talented young paint owners. One of those is Meredith Milton, the AJPHA president who's here to tell you about a special opportunity to reward deserving paint horse exhibitors and take in some great music during the Fall World Show. Thanks, Billy. The goal for my AJPHA Presidential Service Project is to bring more attention to the amazing sportsmanship of our paint youth. I plan to create an endowment that will fund the Youth Superior Sportsmanship Award that is given during the Youth World Show. My hope is to raise enough money to increase this award from $500 to $2,500 to better recognize today's youth and tomorrow's leaders. I hosted a Calcutta at this year's Worldwide Paint Horse Congress, which raised almost $5,000, and I plan to host more in the next few months. But the fundraiser I'm most excited about is the Jeffrey Seal concert at the upcoming APHA Open and Amateur World Championship show in November. Jeffrey Steele is a singer-songwriter, recently inducted into the Songwriting Hall of Fame. And while you may not recognize his name, if you like country music, you've heard his work. He has written hits for artists like Rascal Flatts, Faith Hill, Tim McGraw, Keith Urban, and even Cher. On Friday night, November 7th at 8 p.m., Jeffrey will be in concert at the West Sale Arena in the Richardson Bass Building. Tickets are only $25 and will help fund the Youth Superior Sportsmanship Endowment. If you're coming to the World Show, or even if you live in the North Texas area, this is a great opportunity to hear a very talented guy in a very intimate venue for a very good cause. You can purchase tickets online on the American Paint Horse Foundation website or purchase them during the show at the Member Care or Foundation booths. Back to you, Billy. Thank you, Meredith. If you're planning to attend the National Finals Rodeo, make sure you drop by the Lubricin booth. I'll be there too during special question and answer sessions with one of the leading authorities on lameness and sports medicine, Dr. Steve Alday. In the meantime, make sure to pick up some Lubricin from the APHA General Store. You know, as a member of APHA, you receive a special pricing for Lubricin products for your horse, your pets, and even you. Of course, I hope to see you and your paint horse at the Fall World Championship Show in Fort Worth. I'll be making my rounds with hot coffee every morning, so make sure you flag down the APHA John Deere Gator 
for your free cup of coffee and get you one of these at the store. It's my way of saying thank you and is a prime opportunity to hear your thoughts on ways of improving both the show and the industry. We expect to have about 100 additional horses on the grounds and anticipate those numbers growing even more as we get closer to opening the Will Rogers Memorial Center to the best paint horses in the world. That's all for now. Now go out and show your paint horse with pride and I'll see you down the trail.